Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today, I'm going to show you how to create this impossible circle, or in other words, the Mobius eye that has like these uh, abstract sun rays in it that looks like an optical illusion. This has been inspired from Pinterest from somewhere. I cannot remember, but uh, I'm going to show you how to do this trick. All right, first step, we're going to make the impossible rings. So I'm going to go to the fill. First thing I'm going to do is swap the field to stroke. So I'm going to go to the stroke. This is the stroke. I'm going to select the color. I'm going to go with black. I'm going to select the rectangle from the rectangle, the circle. And I'm going to increase the stroke thickness somewhere around 20. And I'm going to test it out. Press and hold shift plus alt. Create a circle. So I'm going to go back to the stroke. I'm going to increase it. I'm going to go something like this. I'm going to go to the object, expand, click OK. I'm going to press and hold alt drag it down this way it's going to create a copy and make sure to intersect it right here select both of these press shift plus m or you can go and select the shape builder tool which is located here and we're going to connect these elements and then this one right here and this way we have the mobius eye so i'm going to leave it on the fill and I'm going to swap from fill to stroke again. I'm going to select the pen tool, press and hold shift, create a line. From here, we're going to select the rotate tool. Double click on the rotate tool and I'm going to type in six degrees. Click copy, press control D until it goes round and round. I'm going to swap from stroke to fill now. I'm going to select the pen tool and I'm going to make this triangle, you know, go all the way down to the intersection point. And there you go. So basically I want to be left with this one. From here, I'm going to go back to the rotate tool, press and hold alt now and click here on the edge where where's this anchor point. Okay. Click on it. And instead of six degrees, we can duplicate it to 12 degrees. Click on copy. So as you can see, we got a fill and then we got an empty space. But these, you know, the fill and the empty space basically are perfectly equal. You know, the size are perfectly equal. So I'm going to go round and round. I'm going to select them all, right click group. And I'm going to double click on the rotate tool and type in six degrees now and click on copy. So as you can see, something like this. And I'm going to select the Mobius eye. I'm going to also recolor it to some gray. Right click group. And I'm going to pull this on here. Of course, I'm going to. Okay, I'm going to select the impossible circle. Right click on it. Arrange and bring to front. I'm going to scale it down. I'm going to right click and ungroup it. Okay. So I'm going to select this circle. Press and hold shift and select one of these lines. So it's going to be selected like this and right click as you can see we don't have the make clipping mask so what we need to do is select one of these and go to object and compound path and click on make and now you can select both press and hold shift again select this one so they are selected like this i'm going to right click and now you can select make clipping mask okay do the same thing with this so i'm going to select the lines go to object compound path and make press and hold shift select this circle also right click make clipping mask and there you go this is how you create it and this is it thank you so much for watching and if you're new on the channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can notify with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end have a good one bye bye